Sola Samoa, Sola Sokoa. Solo is coming down the aisle. Samoa. So Solo Samoa. <laughs> Solo Sokoa. AKA Sola Samoa. AKA if that's... Taz had a baby with Samoa Joe, it would be Sola Sokoa. Where does the Taz go? From that gimmick that he's got all the time. With the with, with the black uh towel over the head. What you gonna do? Skip, skip, skip it to it. Oh yeah! What you gonna do? Skip, skip, skip it to it. Oh yeah! What you gonna do? Skip, skip, skip it to it. Oh yeah! What you gonna do? Skip, skip, skip it to it. Oh yeah! What you gonna do? Skip, skip, skip it to it. Can't see me. I can see you clearly. Yes. Well, can you see Cena winning this match? Well, uh, I have no idea. <laughs> There's no way. According to the according to the temperature uh, of 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 Cena, he does not seem too confident. I don't care. There's no way Solo can beat John Cena. I don't see that. There's no way. To me, Solo is, is Shmomo. Shmomo. <laughs> He's a Shmo. Solo is a Shmomo. <laughs> Shmo Sequoia. Why do you okay? Why do you think that that he is a Shmo? Like what what makes you make what makes you have uh, a a Shmo thermometer with this man? Maybe because he's new. <laughs> I don't. I just don't see him as like a mega star. You know? Wow. Way to, Maybe. Way to boost his confidence. There. <laughs> yeah. You can't see me. You ain't gonna see him after this match. <laughs> oh, this is his retirement match right here. The retirement match of John Cena. Because he's thinking about retiring. <laughs> the time is now. <laughs> he just <laughs> mentioned it right there. The time is up. Can WWE afford this man? No. Okay. <laughs> That's the problem. That's the problem. Is he worth that money, though? No. <laughs> of course not. You know what? what I, here's, here's what I think he kind of could be good at. Maybe commentary every once in a while. Maybe. Um, I mean, I could see him on the, on the, the panel in the pre-show. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like how Booker T uh, does his thing, you know? Yeah. I could see him there. I think I think he could be entertaining uh, in in that space, you know? But not as as a permanent thing, or just every once in a while. Maybe every once in a while, you know, yeah. like WrestleManias, Royal right. Rumbles, you know. Mm -hmm. But I think he should call. You know, call like some matches. You know what I'm saying? Like some main matches. Damn, he he looks lit up already. <laughs> yeah. All that practice. <laughs> I think I think they uh messed him up. Well, Solo looks, looks like he's gonna finish this right now with a thumb. Solo, yeah. It's so it's 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 so head spinning that this man for years. Has been on a roller coaster of, of likes and dislikes, <laughs> you know. You either love him or hate him, or you're in between, you know. It's similar to how Roman Reigns was when he was a, a babyface, you know. Yeah, but I think that they made the right choice <laughs> of making him a heel. Oh, of course, you know. Which I think they should have done with Cena. Oh, for real? I wish. But they, they did. did. Dude, he was a heel with him when he did the whole rapping thing. He was just starting out. I'm saying like when he was already ruthless, aggression. When he was already uh, established. Remember when, when, when he had the big him. chain and he's like, yeah, 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 he was a heel. I know. I'm saying they should have turned him a heel when they started booing him as a babyface. 
Okay. When the whole let's go Cena, Cena sucks thing started. Uh huh. Because that was a big problem. Even Roddy Piper was like, you can't be having, you can't be a good guy and having the people boo you. Slap. <laughs> when did that happen? He was on Piper's pit. Really? Piper, Piper was chewing him off because he's like, you're not connecting with the fans. Oh, for real? Yeah. I didn't remember that. Well, <laughs> well. <laughs> you call yourself a fan. Well, so is that. <laughs> He's referring to the fan that is off camera, here, which is not a person. It's a literal fan to keep us cool <laughs> with the bright lights that we got here. Thanks to our Watchamaniacs on Patreon. Thank you. By the way, if you're watching in uh, Saudi Arabia, shout out to you guys. Yes. And comment below if, if you actually went to the event. We're pretty interested in uh, your stories. I could it. put it later, possibly, <laughs> uh, on a shout out. Let us know how the event was. If you enjoyed it, was it your first time, or have you gone before and the other shows were better? Let us know. Yes. By the way, <laughs> um, I do believe, I strongly believe, that some of the elements that they have um, here are from previous WrestleManias, you know. Some of the elements. Because some, some. Um, so like the it's wind. It's very familiar. The wind, the water, the fire. No. <laughs> he said elements. So, so some of the assets or whatever, <laughs> like they use to build the ring and and all that stuff, it's very familiar. I mean, it has that WrestleMania feel to it. So oh, absolutely. So you're saying like some of the stuff that they used to build the that, WrestleMania set. You know what I didn't notice? That was, That's a cool uh, design. They did a jewel in the top of the, the ring. Mm. Like for a crown jewel, that's pretty, that's pretty dope. Yeah. They shaped uh, the thing or whatever to make it look like a jewel. They put a lot of money into this. Oh, man. absolutely. That's awesome. To put on this show. That back, the, the, the back area that you see there, yeah. you know, uh, LED, those are all LED walls. Everything in there is LED walls. And they have one by one panels. I know this because uh, I've seen it myself. <laughs> mm -hmm. it's, it's crazy to maintain that crap. Actually, this, you know what this reminds me of? The New Orleans WrestleMania. Mm. It, has that, it has that vibe to it. Yeah, you know, maybe if we look at the New Orleans compared to this and see see if our suspicions are correct. <laughs> Do they film Crown Jewel in the same arena every time? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know that. Comment below. <laughs> yes, comment below if you know that they film Crown Jewel at the same arena every time. If I had a guess, I would say yes. Because they come, like, what, once a year? Let me ask you this. Would you visit Dubai? Yes. I would love, <laughs> love to visit Dubai. It's become a hot spot. Like, Absolutely, but it's the most expensive hot spot you could have in the world. Well, that's not good. Oh, then we're never going to see Dubai. I <laughs> know. I'm not. <laughs> I can't even see. But you'd like to. <laughs> I can't even see North Florida. That's how. That's how broke I am. <laughs> well, congratulations. Welcome to America. <laughs> <laughs> well, here comes the thumb. Uh oh. Already. Thumbs up. No. That, I mean, obviously it's a nod to Umaga, but I kind of miss Umaga. Well, he's dead. I know. <laughs> but I missed him, like, his in-ring persona. Well, where will he this, Batman? His son is wrestling. And I think he's about to come. I would love to see his son fight Solo. 
Mm, that would be freaking. You stole my dad's gimmick. Yeah. You know? And he breaks his thumb. <laughs> and he breaks his thumb. <laughs> yeah, that'd be cool. Let's let, let's skip to the, the you know because like I I strongly believe Cena's gonna lose this. <laughs> let's cut to the chase. What? What do you yeah. mean he's gonna lose? <laughs> Why do you believe Cena's gonna lose? Because he hasn't done crap in the in the past fifteen minutes. Who the hell is Solo? He hasn't done crap since he arrived at WWE. <laughs> Cena's a legend. You're just you're just mad because Solo doesn't talk. He does talk. Anyways, <laughs> let's cut to the chase. <laughs> let's cut to the chase. WrestleMania 2024. Will The Rock be there? Maybe. I'm not going to say yes. I'm not going to say no. The possibility is there because I've heard him actually talk about it. So it is possible. And here's the thing. Why? <laughs> you know, here, here, does he, okay, there's only one reason, there's only one reason, one reason, okay, get my, get my gist? The ones. Yeah. And that is to pass the torch over to his cousin. Okay. And be like, congratulations, cuz, you deserve it. Number one. Hey, <laughs> yeah, exactly. And they're gonna boo the crap out of the rock. <laughs> uh oh. The only way I see Cena losing this is if he gets caught with the. Listen. Or if he cheats. Solo's been fighting him clean. I know. There has been no interruptions whatsoever. Well, let's see. <laughs> never say never. Well, he's gonna lose right now. There you go. I'm just, I'm just, in, I'm just like, I'm like impressed or whatever of like, that he's kind of sort of dominating Cena, you know? Yeah. But a guy with no shoes. <laughs> oh, most wrestlers with no shoes don't win matches. <laughs> well, <Nah>. okay. <laughs> and with that, we'll, we'll. Well, let it be, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> this is your logic. What do you mean? <laughs> You're like, oh, for a guy with no shoes on, he's doing there's good a, in his there's, match. There's a nod to Rikishi. All wow. his sons are, are dominating <laughs> WWE. It's not really Roman Reigns. <laughs> yeah. You got me thinking about Rikishi and the stink face and the dancing. Yeah. <laughs> That's what that's what that's what Solo needs to do. He needs to dance. Yeah. <laughs> like what two thumbs up. <laughs> Can you imagine that? He breaks character and then all of a sudden <laughs> <laughs> the yeah. lights go out just randomly you know what I'm saying like Roman Reigns is in the middle of talking crap to another opponent and you know what and then the lights go out and the spotlight hits and Samoa's like Samoa's like <laughs> Sokoa <laughs> Solo <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, the lights go out and the spotlight, and he's like. <laughs> Roman Reigns is like. <laughs> no, Too Cool should come out. Too and Cool is dead! <laughs> One of them is. One of them is One dead! Them is. But I'm just saying, if they were alive, they should come out. They dance with him, he dances, and then he does the thumb <laughs> to both of them. To both of them. <laughs> well, since one is dead, they would have to revive him. <laughs> they would have to put him on sticks and then, like, do the dance or whatever. With... <laughs> like Weekend at Bernie's? Yes. <laughs> wow, that's terrible. <laughs> this is fantasy booking, sir. Oh, okay. Fantasy booking. Well, we could do it in a video game. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh! 
And that will make him turn. Oh! Oh, wow! He did it. Yeah, you got him good. That was one spike. <laughs> mm. Oh, okay. He got him again? Yep. Two spikes. <laughs> oh, wow. Three spikes. Let's go, Cena. He's going to do the AA. Oh. That's it. Four spikes. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Eleven. This is sad, man. He beat him clean. He beat him clean. I got to give it to you, sir. That is wow. Eleven spikes, ladies and gentlemen. Eleven. Some people can't even take one. <laughs> I guess he's not a schmo anymore. How the hell? They're going to make him beat John Cena. Well, the supposed John, greatest I already of all told time. You, look, 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 listen to me. I already told you that when he, when he was like depressed and all that crap, he already lost. He, he was already saying or whatever, like, Thinking about retiring. What does that tell you? So he's gonna retire? Yes! This was his, his, his farewell. To go like that? Yeah, to, to be murdered by a thumb. <laughs> Talk about putting him under his thumb. I know. <laughs> Thumbs up, guys. That's what I give this match a thumbs down. Alright, who would you have liked to retire uh, Cena? Roman? That would make more sense than Solo Sequoia. <laughs> well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. He got beat clean. Ladies and gentlemen, Cena got beat clean. No interruptions. He got beat clean, man. You can't say that he didn't. Not even, not even Paul Heyman was out there. No, Paul Heyman didn't do anything. Solo was solo. You see, you see? this is an Undertaker moment. <laughs> is he gonna put his shoes in the middle of the ring? <laughs> that was, I'm telling you, that was the most emotional <laughs> part in our WrestleMania experience to see him take off the hat. And the gloves, remember? And they put it in the middle of the ring. The Undertaker. Yeah. When we thought that he was going to retire. Yeah. I think that that was his last match. Yeah, that was a waste. It was all for nothing because he didn't retire. Yeah, but I think that that was like a sign-off. Yeah. I, would th I think yeah. that was the real sign-off. We was... got to see that live. And then we got to see it after the thing, and the and oh my god, it was so freaking. People were in tears, literally in tears. It felt like a funeral. I know. That right there, ladies and gentlemen, is what spiked Roman Reigns' career. Right there, we got to experience the spark that lit Roman Reigns. Well, that's your opinion, and you're entitled to it. It's true. It's damn true. Yep. That's his retirement. He lost. How's he the greatest of all time? He lost. To a schmo. <laughs> <laughs> well, tell me how you really feel. What a schmo match. Okay.
are leaving. They're so mad. There are people leaving right now. Before it's officially over. Wow.